So people are upset over Dragon Quest female warrior design. Well, people are upset over it. I, I, I don't want to show the actual design because I don't want to get demonetized by YouTube. Because, like, the, no, not, like, demonetized. Like, the video gets demonetized from YouTube, okay? You know, you know, basically, Dragon Quest to free HD review that's Square Enix. Um, 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 yeah. Review the Square Enix will be censoring the franchise artist's original design for the female warrior. Of course, I don't think I can show the female warrior design without, you know, being demonetized for showing too sexual content. Yeah, that's what they, yeah, I cannot, I probably cannot show it, you know. Maybe YouTube made them censor it, you know, you never know. Because, you know, YouTube doesn't want people to be demonetized. Okay, this is the image against maybe so without being demonetized. So basically, this is the original design of the female and male warriors of Dragon Quest Free. Toriyama designed the characters. You know, you can definitely see they look like Dragon Ball characters. Because Toriyama is the designer of Dragon Ball. He actually designed a lot of the early Dragon Quest characters. So, yes, Toriyama's artwork actually... Toriyama's designs actually got into Super Smash Bros. You know, he has a pretty great... Our stylist, you know, he created the iconic Dragon Ball series, you know, but he also is known, but of course people don't talk about his lesser known works on Square Enix properties, like Chrono Trigger, and obviously, you know, Dragon Quest, you know, those are his lesser known works here, here, and also, and this, and, uh, and, uh, Square Enix is replacing male and female options with gender neutral works, yeah, you know, Square Enix, you know, people said that Japan was the last Bastion of you know anti wokeness, you know, but a lot of these, you know, they would rather listen to Street Baby Ink. And where is the new design? We're gonna cross over all of this here. Basically, this is what they did again. Um, at least YouTube would be happy, <laughs> YouTube won't demonetize people for playing this game, obviously. But again, it's just so sad they would rather censor old games instead of making you know, I just don't understand this obsession by these companies to censor old games, like, I really don't get it, like, it's in the past, the history must be rewritten, those types of people, where they want history to be changed, history to be rewritten, you know, character, you know, movies, games to be changed and censored, okay, you know, let's remake this movie, let's remake this game, and change the game, change the, you know, movie, so it doesn't offend anyone, it's just so annoying after a while, like, why are we changing all these games? Okay. And it would be different if they just censored it in the West. Like, who cares? Like, no one plays Dragon Quest in the West as well here. And they also changed the outfit in this mobile game that, you know, that was shut down. So, yeah, no one plays the mobile game because it's shut down. But people are really upset over this, obviously, as well. Because they changed the character's design. You know, to be less, you know, demonetizable, I, I, I definitely see that now. But this is the first, but the censorship is not the most modern change as well. They've changed the genders. Instead, putting A and B body types, you know. Our, our, our common change, you know, developers like to change and develop in games. For example, Toralia. It's just, why do we keep censoring old games? It doesn't make any sense whatsoever, okay? Why just not keep the games as they are, okay? You know, why, you know, I get the remaking the game, but why change the game? You know, you know, as well, of course, making, I, I definitely making, like, quality of life improvements or stuff, but why change, like, like, character designs or stuff to appease these, you know, people? <laughs> to appease these, you know, weirdos on why? I really don't get it. Why we have to appease these weirdos on wine. Goodbye.